Hi everybody, it's Louisa here and I just wanted to share with you my trees. I'm going to show you the one that I have in my living room first. And this is just in a little corner of my living room. I'm going to back up a little bit. I don't want to show you the whole living room, but there's my entertainment center. So it's just over in this little corner here and actually underneath that lamp there. The angel's head just barely touches the bottom of that lamp. I have no other place to put it. And it's just a little tree, maybe four feet tall. Um, I used to have a bigger one that would take up the whole space there. But um, we had a like a large chair sitting here, but we got rid of it. And now it's just sitting on the... a. Uh, um, it's kind of like a little sofa table that my husband had built, and then next to it is a box that it's all covered up with a, like a cream colored tablecloth. So it's just sitting there. The box is supposed to be going, but it's still here, so I just covered it up. So anyway, it's nothing spectacular. On the bottom, I just put some of my little Christmas toys or stuffed animals. Um, they used to have to sit on my entertainment center because... If I had him on the floor when my dog was alive, he would probably either tear it up or hump it. <laughs> but he's not around anymore, but he can enjoy it now. I don't know, he won't tear it up. <laughs> um, and there's a Christmas photo of my husband and I. There's my little deer that tells how many days are left. I haven't fixed the days yet, but you're supposed to just turn the little thing and then you but how many days till Christmas and then my little reindeer here. This is a Target reindeer I had many years. Um, right now, I don't know if I set the lights yet. It's, it's one of those lights that you can set different kinds of flickering. It might be on a steady one right now, but that's fine. Anyway, so it's just all silver and gold. And I had an angel on here. I'll show you that later. But I just changed her now to this new one that I just got at Joann's. Because all their ornaments, a lot of their stuff is either 50 or 60% off on the Christmas stuff. So I think she was 60% off. So, and it's so pretty. It's just white and silver. And it matched my ornaments that are on here. This tree... I don't know if you could see how the edges, the little edges are kind of fuzzy. It's a, um, oh gosh, I forgot what it's called. Cashmere tree. And I had picked that up at Big Lots a few years ago. And it was a pre-lit tree, but um, a couple of years after I got it, the light started to burn out. And this year, I just removed the lights and put on some new ones and fresh ones that actually flicker when, you know, once you set it. I, I didn't set it now. But I just love the cashmere trees. They're, they look soft. I don't know if you can see here. It just looks soft. So all I have are just silver and gold uh, bulbs and... Um, Kind of frosty looking ones with gold on it. Most of the ornaments are probably from Big Lots. I know that these silver ones are from Target. I think I got them last year. And they're um, plastic. So they won't break. Because the glass ones I used to have, they all started to break. But these are glass. So I'm replacing them little by little with just plastic ones. Um, so they don't break. And these heart shaped ones. Somebody gave me this last year. I can't remember who. I believe it was in a swap. So I'm finally using them. So if you remember who you are, thank you for those. I put the whole pack on. And then I threw on this pretty um, pearl trim that I had bought. I think it's from Joann's. I got it last year. I know that much. But um, it's just pearls and gold beading and it's around my whole tree and then this white iridescent with um, pearl I picked that up somewhere a whole roll of this I can't remember where this is a really expensive gold ribbon from Joann's I didn't realize how much it was this is the kind that you have to get cut by the yard 
and I paid way too much for it, not realizing it, but I bought it anyway. And I actually bought it a couple of years ago, two or three years ago, and I just finally used it now in the tree. And that's pretty much it on the tree for this one. Oh, on the bottom, this is also from Joann's, I think. Maybe Big Lots, I don't know. But it's a pretty silver tree skirt with some bows. And it has sequins on it, so it's really cute. So that's pretty much it here. Now I'm going to go... Let me turn on the light. Let me turn on the other light. <laughs> there, so you can kind of see how it looks. Okay, turn on the light again so I can see. Alright, so I'm going to go to my room and show you my little tree, but I'm going to block. As soon as I get there, I'm going to block the view because I don't want you to see something, certain things in here. <laughs> Alright, because I have a project that I'm going to be showing soon for a YouTube hop that I've um, been asked to join, so you'll be seeing that soon. So here's my little tree. I picked this little guy up, um, the tree at AC Moore, and I had, it was a few weeks ago, I had a, actually no, this was on sale for 50% off, so it only cost me about $6. So I did a shabby chic style in here with my little tree. I put on some lights that I got last year on clearance at my supermarket where I work at. So it's just one little strand and I put on some other things on it and I'll show you in a minute. Now what I did to the tree, it's one of those trees that come in a little like a pot or something and it's wrapped in burlap. I left that because I decided to put burlap down here and then I just covered this with lace. Um, and then on the tree itself, and I don't know if you can tell, I actually whitewashed it with some gesso, the entire tree. So it just gave it a bit of a shabby look to it. And then I added this tree skirt that I just bought today. I had like a piece of lace on it, but I wanted to get one. And I just got this at Joann's also. And it's a pretty soft cream colored tree skirt just the right size and then next to it is this cute little snowman that I got maybe last week from Joann's also and he was 50% off when I bought him the tree skirt I think was 60 but I wanted to do like all white and then some pastel colors too next to it is a Dollar Tree Santa that I bought last year from the Dollar Tree um, it might be going on something else. I just hung them there for now. So let me explain the tree. As my star or my topper, I use this gorgeous piece here from Michaels. And that matches that dragonfly. Here's the second one. I had showed you the first one on my stocking. So here's the other one just hanging there for now. And then the little chandeliers also. Um... So my lights, I put on them, this one's kind of coming off, this uh, snowflake, they came off of another set of lights that are battery operated, but I wasn't using them, so I just took them off and put them on here. Um, then I wrapped around this gorgeous pearl trim, and I don't know, I think those are from Michael's. You can barely see them because it got covered up with a lot of the ornaments. But you can see it right here some more. It's just peeking around. These pretty butterflies, they're white with iridescent pink. Um, they also have a clip on the back. I think there are six of them. Those are from Big Lots. I just got those two maybe last week or the week before. I think it's been two weeks since I had this. And the flowers are from my stash, so I just put these large, like, fabric-type white and light pink roses. I just scattered it around. They're not attached. They, they can come right off. And then the little tiny pastel-colored bulbs, 
these are from Michaels and they come in a set so it's just one set of assorted colors from Michaels because they had them 40% off and what else is on here I think that's pretty much all that's on here so I try not to put too much here I did display the gorgeous um, you'll see this again later this pretty um, layout with my family and my dog Kirk that Jane made for me. I'm holding a little something in my Facebook group, nothing but crap. So you're going to be seeing some more layouts from my friends from there. And I just placed this Dollar Tree tray here for now. But I want to put more Christmas things once they get here. And there's going to be another piece coming in. Like I said, I'm in a YouTube hop, so you're going to see another piece. It's probably going to be standing here where I had it. I, I removed it so you guys wouldn't see it yet. <laughs> So that's about it. Over here is that other angel that I was telling you about. She's just hanging about. I got her many years ago. I mean many. At Target. She's already like the... This used to be more white. It's kind of turning yellow. But she's still pretty. So I just hung her in here for now. And there's my stocking. I already showed you that. It's hanging there for now. I might not even keep it. I might be giving this to someone. So we'll see. And then my chandelier things are just hanging out here. I got two of them. Those are from Michael's. They're just hanging out with the rest of my charms and the Halloween charms that um, Muriel made for me. And then we did a swap with. Those are hanging out there. Some extra bottles that I got into. It's a mess in here. But anyway, that's all I'm going to show you because there's a lot of things in this room. My place looks like. Christmas threw up. Been working on those cards, so. Um, so anyway, yep, there you go. My little shabby chic tree. Alright, I'll see you guys next time. Bye now.